Hey everybody, Dr. Mehta here again from Perspective Doctor. Now, a question we get all the time is, what should I major in or what's the best major for a pre-med? This is an awesome question, but has a lot of different potential answers. So let me give you a little bit of a framework of how we like to think about it at Perspective Doctor. So the first thing is that non-science majors can definitely be attractive to a pre-med admissions committee or to a medical school admissions committee. Obviously, the more people that apply with a biology major, the more similar applications the admission committee may see. So if you come in with a really interesting major, that certainly may boost you a little bit in the eyes of an admissions committee. But there are a few things to keep in mind. Number one, the pre-med curriculum is stacked. And since the MCAT changed in 2015, it's actually gotten even more stacked. What I mean by that is you have to take biology, chemistry, inorganic chemistry, organic chemistry, physics, psychology, sociology, math, English, and maybe even biochemistry. That's almost 18 to 20 courses that any pre-med has to take, which can be up to 50% of the courses you take in college. So if you're finding a major that is unflexible or really has a lot of requirements outside the pre-med curriculum, it may be a little bit tough to factor in. With that said, if you can do it, it could serve to your advantage. Now, a couple other things that you wanna keep in mind while thinking about a major. First is that GPA is incredibly important in the whole spectrum of med school admissions. In fact, with the GPA and MCAT, those are the two most important things that any medical school is looking for, and then everything else comes into play. If you can't maintain a high GPA in your particular major, I would say you should think about a different major. A English major with a 4.0 GPA compared to a biomedical engineering major with a 3.2 GPA, unfortunately the English major always wins out no matter how much more difficult the bioengineering courses may be. Keep in mind that whatever major you choose, you want to get the highest possible GPA. Now one last thing to consider. You're going to be studying this for four years and you better be interested in it. So don't just choose a major because you think that a medical school is gonna be attracted to you because of it. You really have to figure out what makes sense for you. What do you wanna learn about for four years? What do you wanna be in classes about for four years? And how is that gonna potentially impact you as a person, as a doctor, as a just general citizen of the world? Find a major where you think you're gonna really excel in because you're interested in it, because you're excited to go to class. That's how you're gonna do really well in your major, that's how you're gonna get a great GPA, that's how you're gonna look good to medical school, and that's how you're eventually gonna get an acceptance. So these are some of the things to keep in mind when selecting a major. There's really no best pre-med major, but for every individual school, there may be really good majors for you as a pre-med to take part in. Remember, if you have any of your questions, feel free to contact us on Facebook, Twitter, or even drop us a line on our YouTube account. We're here to help you. Thanks for checking out that video. I hope you found it helpful. For even more, subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our blog. And remember, if you need help through the MCAT, admissions, or USMLE, Med School Coach has you covered.